Welcome back everyone. Our exciting time together has arrived. Today we are going to learn about primary and secondary colours, do an awesome science experiment, be an artist like Vincent van Gogh. Primary and secondary colours. The arrows are the primary colours. So if you mix red and blue together, mix mix, you will make purple. If you take yellow and blue, primary colours, and you mix mix, it will make green. Look carefully and see how we use primary colours, red, blue and yellow, to make secondary colours. Have a look at this slide. We've got red and yellow and if you mix them together, mix mix, you make orange. Activity 2. Science experiment. Mixing colours. Wow! Look at those colours. So this is what you'll need. Milk, a dinner plate, food colouring, red, yellow, blue, just the primary colours, dishwashing liquid, earbuds, once you have completed the experiment, see if you can discover why this happens. Let's do it. First of all, pour enough milk in the plate to completely cover the bottom of the plate. Allow the milk to settle. Add the food colouring. One drop of each of the three primary colours, red, yellow, blue to the milk. Find an earbud for the next part of the experiment. Predict what will happen when you touch the tip of the earbud to the milk. It's important not to stir the milk. Did anything happen? Now put the other end of the earbud into dishwashing liquid. Place the soapy end of the earbud back in the middle of the milk and hold it there for 10 to 15 seconds. Look at the burst of colour. It's amazing and so exciting. Can you create a repeat pattern using shapes and colours? Start by using two primary colours, then adding a secondary colour. Use a red and a blue shape, then maybe a purple shape. Use white paint to make different tones, shades of the colours. You can even use different sizes of shapes. Have fun making patterns. Look at this artist. He is Vincent van Gogh and he painted this beautiful starry night over the Rhone. Study the painting carefully. Can you find examples of tone? Remember the different shades? See how the blue becomes lighter, darker? Where do you look first when you look at the painting? What do you notice about the brush the artist has used? Always time for more fun. Pretend to be an artist like Vincent van Gogh. Ask mum kindly with all your heart if you could have some paints and try and copy these beautiful paintings. Enjoy boys and girls. See you next time.